Hello everybody. Um, welcome back to Mist. It's been since January that I have recorded one of these episodes. Except not. I recorded the last episode, aka what this was gonna be, a few days ago. And then, just now, I, on accident, deleted it because I didn't label it and put it in the folder that it was supposed to be in. So now I'm re-recording this. Um, I have already seen the ending to this game, unfortunately, now that I've <laughs> recorded that original thing, and I know the solution to this puzzle, but, hey, I can't just leave a series hanging. <laughs> uh, well, I suppose I shouldn't gripe any longer. I, it is now, like, May 29th, and the last episode that I, the last time that I recorded one of these episodes was January 21st. <laughs> so, that's kind of nice. But enough of that. Let's, let's begin. So, the directions you need to go for this are north. Oh my god, I have to do all of this again. I remember it taking a long time the last time I did this. So, ugh. North. West. So now we go west. That's not west. I know my cardinal directions. I promise. Jeez, that is loud. I should probably turn that down a little bit. How's that? <laughs> so now we go north again. You might notice that my microphone sounds a little bit different. Or not. Either way, it's because I reinstalled Windows, which is actually the cause of um, me deleting that original final episode. And in the process, somehow, my usual microphone that I use um, stopped sounding good. So, that's delightful. Anyways, now we go east. Again. And now we go south. So apparently you're supposed to figure this puzzle out by listening to the sounds that each direction makes. I don't know how you're supposed to be able to do that. I assume it was something earlier in this age, the Selenic Age that tells you what each sound is like. Or maybe it's the thing in the mechanical age with like, you know, the island and all that. I think that's probably what it is. So south, and then we're going to go west next. Riveting, I know. So now we go southwest. And then we go west again. And then northwest, northeast, north, and then southeast. This is a long segment. <laughs> like, way too long.
Whoa. Cool sound. So there you go, northwest. I remember that hurting last time I heard it. <laughs> Now we go northeast. And now north. That's not north. <laughs> and now southeast. Once we actually get there. <laughs> I'm not looking forward to watching the book cutscenes again, because those are also long. Hey, I did it! I think in the original recording I messed up. <laughs> Maybe that's why it felt so long, but th that is still seven minutes. Like, it's a long time. Now we have the book. So, you don't really need to listen to what he says because I can give you a summary of it. There's one more thing um, there's one more page, and it's behind the fireplace, and you have to go over here, open this book, and there's a bunch of patterns. You have to go to number 158, because Cirrus tells you to. I went way over, way overboard. Okay, this one. This is the one you need. So... Wonderful sounds. I'm gonna save before I do this. Save. Get the red page. Oh. I'll be quiet now. I'm free! Oh, thank you, my friend. My dear friend, you've done the right thing. You stupid fool! <laughs> it looks like perhaps you're in the book now. <laughs> and what have we here? A page. <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> I hope you enjoy your new home as much as I enjoyed it. I can't see you! You're getting less clear! 
Thank you in the boobs. <laughs> <laughs> the library looks much the same as I left. Oh, I can all. I hope you enjoy books, because now we're in one together. So welcome to the ending of the game. Uh, yeah, that was, n no, of course not. Of course not. That is not the end. That is not the end for Mathilde. No, no, no. But there is two more endings that we need to, to show off. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Steam. Yes. I love you, Steam. Okay. So, as you might remember, there was also a blue page back here. And we had to put in this amazing password again, with this amazing sound accompanying it. Do that. Get the blue page. Turn the game down a little bit because it's really loud. <laughs> okay. Pages you work so hard for. <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, yes. Oh. Perhaps you're seeing the world from my point of view. <laughs> yes. Oh. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> <my brother. laughs> oh, yes. oh. <laughs> Maybe someone will rescue you someday. <laughs> 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 so yeah, it's pretty much the same thing. One thing that does bother me though, why is it that... Like, I understand that Cirrus is terrible, because, you know, he's an ass, but I don't get why Aginaw does it. Like, yeah, he's insane, but, you know, insane people can be nice. Cirrus can't. Okay, so, to get all three endings to this game, you have to put in this passcode three times. I now have it memorized. Let's see what's in this book. Who the devil are you? Uh, don't come here to Donnie. Not yet. Um, oh, I have many questions for you, my friend. Uh, 
as you no doubt have for me. Um, where should I begin? Oh, perhaps my story is in order. Um, my name is Atris. I fear you've met my son, Cirrus and Akinar, in the red and blue books on Mist Island, in my library. My library. Oh, it contains my works, my writings. Oh, I wrote many books, many books that linked me to fantastic places. It's an art I learned from my father many years ago. Oh, but the red and blue books, those were different. Mm, I wrote those books, too. I entrap over-greedy explorers that might stumble upon my island of mist. But I had no idea my own sons would be entrapped. Uh, my sons. Cirrus and Agazar, we had many journeys together. Uh, I gave them free reign to the books. Perhaps it was not wise. Uh, I could see the greed growing in them. I had not told them about the red and blue books. Their imaginations went wild. They dreamed of riches and power. Uh, of course, they did not know the books were traps. They begged me for access to those books, and I, of course, denied them. Ah. Oh, they devised a plan. An evil plan. I had no idea to what extent their greed had, had progressed. Their own mother. He was their own mother. Oh, my dear Catherine. Ah, to lure me here to Dunny. Of course, I... I could return to Mist, except that they removed a single page from my Mist linking book. I cannot return without that page. You, my friend, can bring that page to me. Oh, I pray you believe my story above the lies that my sons have told you. If you could find it in yourself to return that page to me here in Dunny, I could go to Mist and bring justice to my sons for what they've done. I must return to my writing. I pray that you believe me. Please hurry. Bring the page. Bring the page with you. Well, I know where that page is. It just so happens to be one of the first things you do. In fact. Um... The marker switches. Can I please go to the store? Thank you. So... I'm... I can't exactly remember if I have or not, but... Um... I may have shown this. There's a page in here. This is the single page that... Atris has talked about. I always called him Atris, but Atris doesn't sound... Per it doesn't sound right, you know? I don't like it. Oh, I've already forgotten it. No, never mind. Yes, I did. Is that it? Yes, it is. Have you found the missing page? Yes, I have. So this is Denis. D apostrophe N I. Cool doors. Um, there's not much to this place except for this. Ah, my friend, you returned. And the page? Did you bring the page? Ah, give it to me. Give me the page. Okay. I don't know why I. Did the cutscene thing there? You've done the right thing. I have a good choice to make. I know what I must 
I shall return shortly. There was a little bit of big forehead there for a second when he went to the book. Oh, there he is. <laughs> it is done. Uh, I have many questions for you, my friend. But, uh, my writing cannot wait. I fear that my long delay may have already had a catastrophic impact on the world in which my wife, Catherine, is now being held hostage. Cool. <laughs> sure, I guess. Oh, and uh, one more favor. Okay. I am fighting a foe. Uh huh. My Ooh. Scary. In some way in the future, I may find it necessary to request your assistance. Huh. Until that point. I would love to. How do I get there? <laughs> the oh! The book! Yes. I'm smart. Well, that is... <laughs> that is the end. There's... Uh, the remains of the books. Yeah. So, that is missed. I... I did really enjoy this game. Um, I think that Mist is such a... a relic. But it's still... It still has so much to it, you know? There's so much story, so many things, you know? Um, there is a sequel to this game called Riven, which I may do on this channel. I'm not sure when. I would have to research it because I feel like doing this game blind was interesting, but at the same time, not knowing the puzzles can also... I know that in the first episode... Because I did rewatch it recently to see, to like refresh my mind on the stuff that I had said. In the first episode, I said that playing through this game blind would make this playthrough a lot more interesting. Because if you know the puzzles, then you know what to do and it's not as fun. Well, now that I have done a blind playthrough of this game, I think it would be a lot more suited to the style of video that I want to go to, to, um, research Riven before going into it instead of diving into it head first. So, for the time being, that will not be my next playthrough. Instead, there will be a short mini-series between this and what I have planned next, um, that I think you guys will like while I get everything ready for then. So until then, stay tuned. Thank you for watching, everybody. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. And until next time, bye.